Okay guys, this is uh, a non-medic. We're back with the next reel. All my videos are Creative Commons. Feel free to download them, redistribute them, however you feel. Uh, we're going to in interview, uh, I believe his name is Terry. He actually has a lot of information in his head. He just is a little scattered on uh, communicating it. But I support his free speech. And he is out here almost every single day in Sprawl Plaza speaking. Worship Satan. He, he claims that uh, everyone worships Satan on Thanksgiving. When you celebrate Thanksgiving by burning oil, you are worshiping Satan. If you love Satan, you love money. And you want more things for yourself. Satan wants you to love money and love things. He's very right on that. Satan does want you to love money and things. Materialism. Uh, the Bible says the root of all evil is the love of money. So what he says about loving money and things is 100% correct. 20,000 children starved to death today. What would Jesus say? 20,000 children I'm going to be honest, Jesus would say free Palestine and feed the poor. He would also tell the Palestinians their Jewish neighbors. This whole divide and conquer strategy, it's, man, it's, it's their strategy. What else can I say about it? Don't fall for it. We got this uh, girl, she's been challenged on a few things. Uh, you, you might have seen her from a couple of videos the last uh, the last week. I'm gonna ask her about her shirt. So. Can, I, can I ask you something? Are you a Satanist? No. Oh, then what's with the no. Satan shirt? It's, okay, it's not really like Satanism, but uh, it's But my that's his band. symbol. Okay, but it's kind of a symbol that's been co-opted throughout time and actually represents a great deal of people who um, were, have, have rituals that are rooted in um, what people later on called witchcraft. It's actually rooted in Yoruba tradition that come from Africa. Um, you were talking about people that became Santeria and that became um, voodoo and hoodoo. Um, these symbols actually have to do with paganism and it have to do with like um, not worshiping but like respecting the earth and doing rituals on that. Um, the people, the singer on this shirt. Well, I, I just want to say, funny you speak of paganism because I don't know if anyone here knows, but the swastika is a pagan symbol. Originally, it's found yeah. in the Baalbek temple. Yeah. Uh, uh, that it was it's in the monkey Indonesia. temple in Indonesia. And they co opted it and they made it represent the uh, So even though that might be so, the original meaning, okay, that's like a peace sign. This is the problem. The peace sign that we see that we identify as peace. And the, that, the that Pepe symbol, symbol is now a race symbol where it originally wasn't. Okay. Uh, yeah, I see. The peace symbol that people identify as the Vietnam War that could clear disarmament. It literally means that. But however, people see it consciously, they're going to associate it with the sense of your Because of the fact that what happened in Nazi Germany happened, they happened to say, yeah, that's now as a collective uh, societal conscious, it means that. I know, that's so why I, I won't wear it on my shirt. Yeah. I, I understand that. Yeah, but I also, but, I, I mean, anyone wants to ask me what this means, I can explain and then why I let If they want to dictate me as a Satanist, well, well, King, so so King Solomon uh, used those symbols to send demons. It actually yeah, drove him mad yeah. and drove him to suicide. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah, it, yeah. it's called Satan's sigil magic or Satan's seal magic. No, okay. In fact, the, the Google Play logo is is a part of his si <laughs> talk anymore. Uh, you know, as a recognized Google developer, you know, I had to say that the Google Play logo is the sigil of Satan. The Bible condemns Arsenal in five and Acts chapter seven. It uh, condemns the Hebrews who, who took up the banner of their star god, which it calls Remphan, Molech. Uh, I don't want to draw the...